Hey, EXP Commercial, Robert Creamer here, 7S Network. Hope you're doing awesome. Just wanted to give you a quick showcase of CoStar in case you've never seen it. Uh, quickly about CoStar and the reason that we're asking for 12 months up front is because they are a single payer system, meaning everybody who signs up, the entire bill has to come to me on a 12 month subscription. So I can't have uh, you know 100 subscriptions and then people leave and I'm liable for the bill. So we can't have that. That is the reason we ask for that 12 months up front just to get that taken care of. Also, the security with CoStar to log in is pretty unique. It, it makes it really difficult to share information. So when you log into CoStar, let me see, I was logged in earlier. Okay, when you log in, you input your email, password, it sends a message to your cell phone saying, would you like to log in to CoStar? you hit yes, my phone pops up a QR code reader, and now I have to scan this code that's gonna pop up on the screen, there you go. So now I can log into CoStar, that's pretty crazy, that's, that's high end security for a website. But here we are, going to the home page, which has a ton of articles, a lot of good information, they did a pretty good job with their website, but the main thing, this is a data source, right? So we have all the data we could almost ever need. We have all properties right here for lease properties, for sale properties, all the sale comps, lease comps, tenants. You can do reverse searches, run analytical reports, see when leases are up. It's a great way to market and find leads. And the best part is CoStar is more than happy to train. They get paid more on the may, on the more page views that you'd use. So keep that in mind. But let's do a quick search just in case you've never seen the back end of CoStar. We'll do a for sale search. It's going to default pop up to Austin area. Why don't we try office buildings right here? Existing office buildings. Let's see here. As an investment. And this is what pops up. This is the MLS for the commercial world. We can go to results list and it pops it up like this where it goes through address, name of the property, sale price, price per square foot, or results detail. Like for example, this property right here in Austin, Texas with Wes Walters, great guy, is for sale for $11.5 million, $171 a foot, 6.61% cap rate, there's the NOI. It's been in the market 44 months. That is a long time to be on the market. All right. That's the summary. You go into detail on the property. Leases. It's got lease comps in the area. What space is available. It should have floor plans, diagrams. You can click on tenant and look at the tenant mix to see what tenants are there. A lot of them will have move-in date or expiration date. That's how you can reverse uh, search to get leads. Find out when their lease is up and ask if they're happy renewing or want to move. It's got the tax record info under assessment. It's got who to contact, the owner, management company, you name it. It's got images. It's got a map. It's a really good tool. Also, when you go to print reports, you can select all, just this one, and the reports are pretty good. Let's just look at a one-page sale listing report just so you can see what that looks like. This is what we send to our clients typically when we run a report. Now, normally it'll have more than one property. I just wanted you to see this and see what kind of product CoStar spits out for us. And remember, LoopNet, which is owned by CoStar, is more of the marketing arm where CoStar is really data-driven, right? CoStar will list your property for free because they want all the data they can get. So this is a typical, just a one-page synopsis of what this property has and is that you can send over to your clients. Now, once the, it's like a snapshot. They get this and they can should be able to tell pretty quickly, do I like this property? Do I want more information? And then it's our job as realtors to go contact the broker and get all that information. Let's take a quick look at a lease property. I'll do an office as well. So we go to lease, open up leases. 
it'll default to Austin again. Let's do the same thing, office lease. Let's say 1,000 square feet to 2,000 square feet. Contiguous. There you go, tons of product in the North Austin arena. If we go to results detail, it'll pop up that first property. And again, just all the information. Has pictures, talks about the property, what parking ratio it is, what space is available, what the rates are, what it's near via public transportation, traffic counts, And there you go. So it has all this information. It's got all the contacts. It's just a great tool. I mean, we really need to use this almost every day in our business if you're searching at a high level for your clients. So this and LoopNet are the two tools that we use the most frequently, and that's why we included them in the network because they are so important and it's so difficult for, um, so let's say the average broker to pay $1,500 a month for this product. It's a ridiculous cost and no one should be liable for that kind of money just for searching properties. So we're super excited that it's only going to be $337 a month and we're uh, just, just glad to share it. So if you all have any questions, reach out, uh, ask all the questions you can. Let's get you CoStar, get your LoopNet, get your rock and roll. And let's make 2019 the best year you've had yet. Thanks, guys. We'll talk soon.